with me now is Shanique from Mary to Medicine LA. Hi, Shanique. How are you? Hello. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> oh, you're so happy in quarantine. I love to see it. Listen, it's early. I'm coffeeed up. That's all it is. Lots of coffee. <laughs> yeah, it's all smoke and mirrors and caffeine. I got to ask, you know, how are you keeping busy during quarantine? How's it all going for you? I am extremely busy. So being a property manager, I am considered essential. So I'm still having to work. I know. I go into the office two days out of the week and I work from home three days. I have two kids at home, a six-year-old and a 12-year-old. So yeah, mommy has turned into a elementary school teacher and middle school teacher. It's a headache. That alone is keeping me busy, just trying to keep up with the kids and just everything else. You know, it's a lot. Well, I mean, from a non-parent to one, I, I'm sure you're working so hard and we're just so grateful to get this time with you. We really appreciate mm -hmm. it. I'm sure you're Thank knocking you. it out of the For park. You know, I want to get into Married to Medicine. Season two yeah. premiered on Sunday with a bang. Yeah. You know, there are two new ladies joining the crew this season, Dr. Kendra and Leah. How did the ladies mesh with the rest of the cast when they came on? So it's an interesting dynamic. I mean, these two ladies have really strong personalities. And of course, myself, Imani, uh, Br Britton, and Jasmine all already have strong personalities. So that's already, we already have an established friendship. So having these new girls, ladies in the mix have really turned it up a notch, like a lot. <laughs> in a good way or a, or a mixed bag kind of way, Shanique? I'm going to say a mix, good, bad type of way. <laughs> all right. Well, do you feel like they were accepted right off the bat? Did everyone give them a chance or were you guys all a little skeptical of them? I mean, <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know me, I'm like, you got to prove yourself to me coming into this. You know, I am loyal to a fault. And my thing is, if you're going to be, you know, a part of this group of women and this friendship that we've already established, like you got to prove yourself to me, you know? And so that's just, but of course, I'm going to give you a, I'm going to give you a chance. Are you telling me that they stir up a lot of drama this season more than the vets of Married to Medicine LA? Is that what you're telling me, Shanique? I mean that, no, no, but they did def they, they definitely stir the pot quite a bit. Okay. <laughs> a lot. The pot was stirred the entire season. It was, it was a very, uh, yeah, it was a roller coaster of a season. Well, last season, you and Asha had some serious drama. Where do you two stand right now? We don't stand together. <laughs> Wow, you guys did not reconcile at all. Do you even talk, dare no, I say? not at all. It's just, I mean, it's just one of those things where it's like you just had to cut it off. There was a lot of lines that were crossed, you know? It's like to build a friendship with someone that is just a, you know, a liar that have, you know, really, it's just, it's just hard to move on from which, um, what happened. Well, do we see you two sort of not standing together, as you say, this season? Or do we, will that change this season? Um, we're definitely not standing together. Wow, such hard words, Shanique. I can't wait. Oh, my God. Well, now, we know that you wanted to quit your job and dive into the world of luxury real estate, but your family is a little hesitant about that change. Sure. Did you feel they were being unsupportive or looking out for you? Um, both. Um, you know, that, that's a big deal. You know, my family is used to me being there. I, mommy comes home, mommy's cooking dinner, mommy's fixing, putting everything together. They're used to a routine. And I would say both my kids, as well as my husband, they're very spoiled, you know, and they have these expectations of mommy. So, you know, for me, I feel like I want to try something different um, and for me and not just for my family. And so that's why I'm, you know, that's where this all came from. You're trying to keep your sanity. Nothing wrong with that. Where <laughs> does your real estate career stand right now? Um, I would have to say, you guys have to watch to find out where uh -huh. it stands. Uh -huh. Well, before I let you go, what can we expect from the rest of the season? What's going to oh go my. down? Give me some teasers. This season is going to be explosive. I mean, I felt like last season it was just the same ongoing drama. And I feel like this season it was just ups and downs and people going crazy. I mean, it was intense. This season was very intense. We wrapped filming like the end. We wrapped, I think, around the end of December and I was exhausted. 
I exhausted. It was physically and mentally exhausting, but it's going to be good. It's going to be completely different from season one, where I think all the ladies were ready to bring it. We got rid of the dead weight, and so now we've got people that are ready to play. Married to Medicine LA is like, it's going to be different this season. I mean, Bravo is really turned it up a notch for us. Wow, what a teaser. Shanique, thank you so much for joining me today. I can't wait for the new season. Good luck in everything. And of course, being a mom, of course. Thank you so much for having me. I really appreciate it. Stay safe out there. You as well. People, don't forget to watch Married to Medicine Los Angeles. It airs Sundays on Bravo at 9, 8 central. 